War always carries a cost. And my war on crime is no different. The truth is, no matter how hard I fight, sometimes I have to lose. In order to save Selena from this fate, I had to give myself up. My life for hers. Now, there's nothing to stop Harley Quinn and her crew from killing everyone at the Sanctus facility and stealing a virus that could wipe out Gotham. Meanwhile, I face the cold embrace Try the auto locks on this chamber. I need to prime it before I can activate it. I'm here. I'm here. Harley had me thrown into one of Freeze's cryo chambers. But I'm okay now. Oh, well, that's a relief. I'm afraid I was starting to panic. I've got it under control, Alfred. Is the pact still in the subway? No. I'm bringing the car around. Call Waller. Tell her the pact means to slaughter their way into Sanctus, and I'm going after it. What? Shot on sight, Bruce. I'm not going as Bruce. It's time to let Batman handle things. sign of Harley or the others. spa workers. More death and destruction. This blood trail looks like they dragged something. Looking for Project Lotus. <laughs> Batman, get out of here or I'll shoot, I swear to God. Where did they go? They went down in the elevator. 
Do you have access? It's gotta scan my eyes. <sighs> Another use for Riddler's eyes. Call it for me! No way! Those freaks are down there! They'll kill me if they see me. If you do it, I can stop the intruders that attacked you. Uh, I'm not supposed to let anyone in there. But... All right. You gotta stop them. Send paramedics. I've already made the call. I contacted Director Waller. She, um, wants to speak with you. Now. Put her through. Batman, where are you? Give me a status update. I'm at the Sanctus facility. I split with the Pact, and they beat me here. It's a bloodbath. I ordered you not to blow your cover. What the hell were you thinking? You could have been there to prevent this. I was thinking about stopping the pact, which is way more than you're doing right now. Don't make this a fight with me. Just look at the bodies and ask yourself if it was worth it. We'll be there to back you up soon. We're gonna put an end to this once and for all. Looks like Sanctus security barely slowed them down. That's why you have to keep them there until we arrive. That virus cannot be allowed to leave the facility. Don't mess this up again. The store lock requires a key card. His final moments must have been painful, horrific. <sighs> Scientist. <coughs> Easy. You'll just injure yourself more. It's too late for that. Stop them. Here. Take my... Security didn't stand a chance. Those green lights seem odd. Remind me of Riddler. Unless I say so. We don't know what half this stuff does. What are you doing? You saved my life by taking the rap for the laptop theft. I'm returning the favor. I'm on guard duty along with three gunmen who are all watching that door up ahead. If I hadn't stopped you, you'd be full of holes right now. We don't always see eye to eye. But I'd much prefer you in one piece. I'm just glad to see you alive. Same. 
After seeing them throw you in Frieza's meat locker, I wasn't sure if that was the end. I've seen a lot of death recently. Harley encouraged Freeze and Bane. They killed anyone they wanted. I should have done something more to stop them. But I didn't. Bane! What did I say about touching the equipment? <laughs> Be quiet, you imbecile! I'm going to make this right. I'll help you stop them. Whatever I have to do, they're not getting that virus. Whatever it is, I can do it. Good. We'll fight them together. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Anything in here could kill you. So keep your hand to yourself. Let's do this. It's an automated extraction process. You can't rush it. Uh, I've seen Freezy's popsicle wife move faster than this thing. on us, kitty. I weighed my options and what can I say? I don't like to lose. You made a big mistake. The virus is almost extracted. All right, Bets. What made you think you'd be able to stop all of us? I wouldn't put money on your chances of walking out of here. Maybe we should try a therapy circle. I know all your tricks, Harley. Please. I know your type. You think you know me, but you're so, so wrong. Unfortunately, we have a tight schedule. But I always have time to kill you. Get him, boys! Go find your own hero. 
Tiffany and tell her to get to the manor. Harley escaped with a virus. Right away. Get me a proper lockdown crew in here, Stat. I want bio scans on freeze. Do not let him out of that airlock. Move it, people! Good work here, Batman. Good work? Harley escaped with the Lotus virus. Your girlfriend, Catwoman, is nowhere to be found. Same goes for your boy, John. So if good work means half the pact is loose in Gotham, and we've got a megavirus in the hands of a psychopath, then yes, this is picture perfect. Oh, I could think of some more colorful words to describe this situation. Catwoman and John are not a concern. Our focus needs to be on Quinn. As much as I hate to admit it, you have a point. Sanctus, right under our noses all this time. Chemical weapons, human experimentation. Sanctus was, is, the darkest part of the Agency's history. Oh, this place is just evil. And that's why we're shutting it down once and for all. We can take some of this equipment and put it to good use. This facility needs to be burned to the ground. I don't want so much as a trace of it left in my city. 
Why don't you let me worry about that, Batman? I'm gonna need your help tracking down Quinn. She's out there with the virus, and that's a threat to Gotham we simply can't allow. Freeze must have an idea about where she'd go in these circumstances. <laughs> don't waste your time with that maniac. He'd say anything to throw us off track. But he's our best lead. Well, I disagree. Freeze is nothing more than a science experiment gone awry. You best keep your focus on Harley and the virus before anyone else gets hurt. That was strange. She just completely shut me down. She's normally so open to all possible leads. This is so unlike her. Waller was out of line. She should know better than to ignore your instincts. Usually she does. Listen, Director Waller may think it's a waste of time, but I say leave no stone unturned. I'll see what I can find out. Hey, Will, give me a hand with this, will you? I think there may be something we can salvage back here. to yourself. I wanted you in jail. <laughs> Perhaps you're right. I'm here to talk about Harley Quinn. I need your help to find her. If you want me to tell you what I know about Harley, I'm going to need something from you in exchange. The agency intends to keep me prisoner with this virus living inside me. They mean to study me. Given the chance, I could beat this just like Riddler. He became stronger for it. You're saying Riddler became infected with the Lotus virus when he worked for Sanctus. If he could survive it, I believe I can too. <clears throat> That dial, there, they've keyed it into the temperature regulators in the airlock. All I need from you is to turn that dial. Let my body do the rest. Lower the temperature in the airlock. I know that I can fight this. I will do that for you. But first, tell me what you know. I'm so glad you're agreeable. The truth is, the Lotus virus doesn't have to be this. Riddler's blood can turn the virus into something that can heal. That's why we stole his body. Why your friends in the agency had it on ice. My Nora will perish if I don't use the Lotus to save her. Bane merely hoped to cure himself of his addiction. Harley already has the virus. And now she needs a blood sample from Riddler's body. With it, she will have what she needs to create the serum. She'll go for the body first. That's how you will find her. I already have samples of the blood. Look for a temperature-controlled container. No. You have what you came for. Please, do as you promised.
I need to get to the subway right away. If Harley's trying to make this serum, she'll go straight for Riddler's blood. I'm coming with you. The secondary properties of this virus. The serum they want to make from it. I've got a feeling Director Waller didn't want us to hear that. Which would explain why she steered you away from Freeze. What is she up to, I wonder? Waller always operates on some hidden agenda. Surprised you're only just realizing. I... I guess I'm not. Just realizing, that is. I guess I just have blinders on when it comes to people I look up to. Don't worry about that now. If we hurry, we can intercept Harley at the lair. We could use Bruce on this one. The less attention we draw to ourselves, the better. What does that mean? If Harley sees Batman coming, she may do something drastic. But if she sees Bruce, she'll think she can take you. You don't know I'm the one that told Waller who you really are. Hmm. Are, are we... Are we all good? I'd like to clear the air, in the interest of full transparency. It's your job to figure people out. Can't hold it against you. <sighs> I'm glad you see it that way. I suppose I should have seen this coming. She's become more and more erratic since she came to Gotham. I hardly know what she's going to do next. Harley? No. Director Waller. I'm not used to her keeping me out of the loop. Ah! Damn! Ow! Ah, the hell is wrong with this thing? Oh, damn it, sorry. I... I... I've got a passive anti-surveillance system running. It must have triggered What did your... you say, Bruce? Looked like you were speaking, but can't hear so well without these. I was saying the car as a passive security system. It triggered feedback in, in your hearing aids. Crappy agency technology. Not your fault. Look, it's fine. I'd just rather not talk about it. I have to admit, a part of me was sort of hoping we'd be taking the Batmobile. Not that this car isn't great, but, you know, it's no Batmobile. Oh, we are taking it. I don't follow. I push a button, the armor plates flip, and voila, Batmobile. That's incredible, if you're not just pulling my leg. Yeah, Lucius Fox was a genius. You've put a lot of time and energy into this crusade. I prefer to think of it as a mission. Do you ever question it? Not the mission. I mean, the methods. The clandestine nature of what you do. The fear tactics. The occasional brutality. No judgment. No. Never. I wish I had that kind of confidence. I'm having a bit of an existential crisis. Existential crisis? <sighs> yeah, it's Waller. Why wouldn't she want us to know what Freeze told you? Things have gotten gray recently. Too gray. I don't know if I'm on the right side anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have brought this up. You should trust your instincts. They're what make you good at your job. I'm glad to hear you say that. It bothered me when she allowed the pack to obtain Riddler's body. Wait, that was intentional? I've had deep reservations about Waller. <sighs> Can't believe I just said that out loud. But you told her I was Batman. Bruce. Are you sure you're okay to do this? 
Absolutely. You know, I looked through Gordon's case files about Harley. Her father suffered from mental illness that eventually drove him to suicide. An illness with a strong hereditary link. It's very possible she wants this serum to prevent the same thing happening to her. If she fails, she's got one deadly plan B. <laughs> Don't sound so worried, Batman. I'm here to help. We're almost there. If she has Riddler's blood, she'll be incredibly dangerous. You don't need to tell me. She tried to freeze me to death. Then we're on the same page. She must be gone already. Do you think that means she already has the vials? I don't know, but it's worth a look. Maybe she got scared off before she could find them. Hey, Avesta, does this look familiar? We call it a liminal device, a not quite as powerful phalanx key. Some agency field ops are issued one, and if they left it, they must have been rushed. An agency team has been here. Not as good as something Lucius would have made, but I'm still keeping it. was supposed to preserve him. Obviously, it failed. Right. Decomposition is actually accelerated. They purposefully disabled the capsule. If that's the case, then they were trying to destroy the body. It's textbook asset denial. But it's some sloppy work. They were moving fast. Too fast. If Harley decides to release the virus, that sample may be the most valuable weapon we have. Alfred, I did a bioscan of Riddler's corpse. I'm sending the data to you. The body is breaking down, so do your best with it. Received, Bruce. It's... Oh my. This may take a bit of time. What is it? They're gone. The vials are gone. So, we're having a pretty good day. They ruined Riddler's body and the vials are gone. So... Keep looking. C4. Plastic explosive. Only a little, though. Must be remnants from something... bigger. I don't remember Bane making bombs, and it doesn't match Freeze's M.O. Wonder if whoever took the vials also made a bomb. C4 certainly doesn't sound like the agency. Who then? Harley? John? Even money on both. So, Waller takes the blood and has Riddler's body destroyed. That would make her the only player who could create a viable Project Lotus sample. Having all the pieces to the puzzle. Oh my god. Bruce. The Pact all had problems. Medical problems they needed solving. And if Waller's the solution, she can make them work for her. 
She's not above using leverage to get people under her thumb. I mean, look what she did with my identity. Harley. The virus. Where is she, John? Where's Harley? I don't think we've been formally introduced. Doe. John Doe. <laughs> She's a friend, John. Our friend. I had a friend. Oh, it didn't work out. Oh, hey! Hold on. Are you two-timing cat lady, Bruce? <clears throat> she was here. Wait, she was here? Yeah. Where is she now, John? This is important. You got some real nerve. You know that? Buddy! Remember the cafe? Just manipulate her, John. Did I stuck my neck out for you? Way out! Bane nearly ripped my head off! And for what? She flew the coop! I have nothing! You steered me wrong! At every turn! Every bad piece of advice! Everything blew up in my face! This isn't my fault. Harley betrayed us. Both of us. Yeah. But you weren't in love with her. Point! It's over! The pact! The dream! Us! Not yet, it's not. She's still out there, with a deadly virus in a city full of innocent people. Call me when you got something I care about. It always surprises me how heavy guns are. It's gonna be okay, John. I promise. I care, John. You know that. I'm nearly out of reasons to believe you anymore, Bruce. Well, it's been real. What are you doing, John? Leaving. There's nothing left for me here. A lot of bad memories. And a weird smell. John, I understand you want to run. I've run before. But problems, they just come with you, no matter how far you go. Nope. Pretty sure I can get away from that smell. Damn it, John. Listen to me. I need to find Harley. I don't want to do this anymore. Not for you. Not for her. John, please. This is important. I know it hasn't been easy for us, but I am your friend. Hey, buddy. Look, the agency was here. They took the blood. I was up here in a very dark place. They didn't find me, but Harley did. I told her what happened to Riddler. <laughs> she gave me this. And where do you think Miss Quinn is now? We'd like to find her sooner rather than later. I don't want to find her. My heart can't take another kicking. I don't ever want to see her again. She ruined me. I, I can't. You need closure, John. Face to face. 
Nothing else is going to make you feel better. I promise you that. I just can't say no to you, Bruce. <laughs> you gotta keep an eye on this guy. That Wayne charm gets him every time. You sure know how to spin things. All the right ways to uh, twist my arm. It's going to take me a few hours to find her. I have to check a few places, do some things. Okay, we'll come with you. <laughs> no, you won't. There will be plenty of time for John and Bruce later. This is... I need to do this alone. I'll call you when I find something. Wait, hold on. We really like your help, John. Are you sure you won't reconsider us coming with you? It's okay. Go. Bruce, let's talk about this. He'll come through. He's done it before. It's funny. When you first walked through that door, I honestly thought you came here to check on me. I'm going to track down those vials in the agency's cold storage. Be careful. Thanks. Alfred, how's the bioscan analysis going? Nearly complete. I should have it ready for you when you arrive. I'm on my way. I'm back. I'm taking over at the computer. What's the matter? Uh, Thomas, uh, let's... let's chat. Now's the time. Shh, 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 Alfred, Alfred, it's just a dream. No, uh, I, will, I will not be quiet, Thomas. Martha and Master Bruce aren't safe with those people in the house. No, you, you need to think of your family. Please, please wake up. Bruce, I... Where, where, where am I? Easy, easy. You're in the cave. Take your time, think back, and tell me exactly what happened. Oh, no, it was... It was nothing. I was... I was working and I felt... I felt dizzy for a moment. Uh, I, I must have been more exhausted than I realized. First it's your hand shaking and now you're... You're passing out. We, we can't keep ignoring this. You need to be looked at before it gets worse. Uh, oh, Ted. Hey, uh, hey, 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 be careful. Oh, oh, thank you, Bruce. I'll just catch my breath. Just give me a moment, please. It's all nonsense. What is? Freeze's magic cure-all, it doesn't work as intended. Take a look.
The bioscan of Riddler's body. I used the analysis you sent me to simulate its interaction with the virus. And the bat computer promptly found holes in Freeze's calculations. Lotus. Megavirus. Only one known survivor. Riddler. Freeze thinks his blood is now a key to unlocking Lotus's true potential. It appears that Lotus can be synthesized into a restorative agent for the human body. A remarkable one. Well, Freeze got that part right, but... But as soon as Lotus repairs any physical problems, it causes irreparable damage to the subject's brain chemistry. It drives you insane. It's what Riddler meant when he said, I wasn't always like this. All of these people, all of them trying to kill each other for something that will make them as deranged as he was in the end. We all should know by now that miracles come with a cost. Lotus is nothing more than a poison. Harley's already insane, Alfred. I doubt she's worried about taking it up a notch. Yes, you're probably right. Although if she wants the serum to avoid what happened to her father, well, <laughs> it's certainly ironic. Run the simulation again, then forward the readings to Special Agent Imana Vesta. Ah, I already ran it several times myself. I, I wanted to, to be thorough. Silly notion, I know. My problems are purely psychological. My real cure is a very long vacation. Somewhere far away from Gotham. A place where the sun actually comes to visit. Maybe if you'd listen to me and start seeing your therapist. Uh, yes, yes, I know. It's just... The more I talk about my kidnapping last year and my rescue by Batman, the harder it is keeping certain details a secret. You should understand that. Avesta. I read your report. The serum makes the whole thing beyond dangerous. Did you find out where Waller's keeping Riddler's blood? Yeah. She's got the area on lockdown, but I think I can get myself in. And then I'm taking these things off the table. Permanently. It's too risky. We can figure something- I won't let Waller turn the agency back into something like Sanctus, Bruce. It's not up for debate. Good luck. Let's get you somewhere more comfortable. Oh, Bruce. Uh, Tiffany's up there. She's probably wondering where I hurried off to. I'm sorry, Al, but we can't risk you falling again. Very well. Oh, we, we mustn't keep Tiffany worrying any longer. She's done quite enough of that the past few days. Ready? I'm afraid that's all we do. Worry the ones closest to us. Uh, okay, yes, thank you. The doctor is on her way. How are you feeling? Well, better. A little more rest and some tea and I'll be as good as new. Make that a lot more rest, Alfred. You're hurt. The only thing hurt is my pride. Which, sadly, even the doctor won't be able to fix. You can put up a strong front, but I'm not leaving your side until the doctor arrives. Got it? Understood. Be straight with me. How worried should I be? You don't need to sugarcoat it. I just need facts. It's nothing to worry about. Yes, quite right. So let's please talk about something else. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's just... There's a lot more to worry about right now than me. Well, there is something else. I know this isn't the best time, but I need your advice. Director Waller's people reached out after the incident at your office. They said they were impressed with my skill set. We got to talking, 
and well, they offered me a job with the agency. The training would start immediately, but it'd be a big step for me. I've been working with the agency, so let me warn you. Waller's dangerous. Yeah, I've done my research. I know she's got a bad rep. But maybe we need dangerous people for dangerous times. This isn't what your father would have wanted for you. I think he'd be proud. I'd be using my skills to fight crime. To protect others from losing their loved ones. Wayne Enterprises? It's hard there, Bruce. I see my dad in every hallway. I hear his laugh around every corner. And you, you're not around. I'm left to myself with shadows and ghosts and secrets. Waller's tough, I know that. But she is ready to take me under her wing. She knows how to get things done. Alfred's right. Don't make this mistake. Okay. I trust you. You know them better than I do. So what's the deal? If you think they're such bad news, why are you working with them? Are they pressuring you into it? I mean, you seem like you do what you want. So maybe there's something going on that I don't know about. Yeah, as a matter of fact, they did. That's what I thought. Whatever they have on you must be pretty big. Bruce, just... Just let me in. We used to be so close. Oh, for heaven's sake, Bruce, just tell her. Tell me what? This is why I need to try something new. Alfred needs to rest. He's had a very rough time. If you can't trust me, I don't know why I should listen to you. At least Waller and her people want to work with me. You just want to shut me out. And that's sad. It's really, really sad. Consider this my notice. I'm accepting the agency's offer. I have to go. We'll be waiting right here. John?
god, oh god, please. You're not making this easy on me, you know? We can say the truth. It, it, it wasn't me. I, I, I mean, it, it was me, but it, it was self-defense. I, I know it needs... Bruce? I'm so glad you're here. Please, it just... It, it's, it's not what it looks like. I, I can explain. Just try and reserve judgment. Take a deep breath, John. Just calm down. It was horrible. Just horrible. But you're, you're right. I, I should do my exercises. Get a hold of myself. What happened? Is Harley here? She left just as I got here. The agents. Looking for her. They're not supposed to just start shooting, Bruce. They're supposed to say, hands up! I've seen it on the TV. They just attacked you. I tried to talk sense into them, but they wouldn't listen. They, they just wanted blood. Something took hold of me. Something dark and vicious and desperate for survival. I grabbed the nearest thing and started swinging. <laughs> you think this is funny? I'm, so, I'm sorry. I, I always laugh when I'm nervous. You said you hit them with something. I think so. I, I just grabbed whatever came to hand. This woman has a gunshot wound. Oh, really? In the back. Oh, yeah, it's, uh, it's... It's coming back to me now. She was going for her partner's gun, and I... I just, I just went on autopilot. I didn't stop until I was safe. I've just been sitting here in the dark until you came in okay sounds sounds like you did what you had to do exactly it was a real life or death moment i just sort of closed my eyes and hoped for the best i felt so much rage inside me bruce it was terrifying it was like it was like i became someone else Someone dangerous, but someone you want around when your back's against the wall. Well, I hope you're okay now. You think you're back to your normal self? Normal? Yes. I feel much better. Thank you. You don't have to worry about a thing. It was a momentary episode. A, a flash in the pan. It won't be a problem. I promise. You, you believe me, don't you? You have faith in your good old buddy John, right? Of course I believe you. Oh, good! Thank you, Bruce. Thank you. Thank you. I wasn't sure I could count on you. Not after you drank Harley's slushy when I told you I was in love. Not after the raid. It's been hard, knowing you haven't been straight with me, Bruce. Keeping your secrets. When we're supposed to have all this trust between us. Straight with you? You're telling me you don't keep secrets from me? Oh, Bruce, there are secrets, and then there are secrets. Yours is definitely a secret. You forget, I know you. Real you. Always hiding behind some kind of mask. Playboy, B. 
businessman. Criminal. Bat. Ooh. Dun, dun, dun. You can't fool a friend. Someone who really takes the time to look. You are the Batman. You think whatever you want. It makes no difference to me. You don't have to keep your mask on anymore, Bruce. Not with me. After you fell on your own sword to save Catsy, there was no more doubt. So what? You think you can use that against me? Huh? Blackmail me? I would never! We're two threads in the same stitch, remember? Oh, my head feels all messed up right now. I need a purpose. I know where Harley is. She took a truck out of the city across the Gotham Bridge. Let me help you stop her. You and me, Batman. We can clean up this city together. Unless... Uh, uh, unless the stitch is truly broken. In which case, uh, we should both go our separate ways. When this is over, we will have a very serious talk about all this. But right now, let's go find Harley. We'll bring her in together. Oh, gosh. Thank you, Bruce. I'm going to do such great things. Uh, oh, sorry about the blood. We've got to catch up with Harley before these murderous agents find her. She's got explosives and the virus. If they start shooting, things could get really exciting. Oh, boy! <laughs> if I had known these were your wheels, I never would have stolen that beater. To. I mean it! The bridge and every sad son of a bitch on it! The blood is gone! The serum you want is no longer an option! Stand down now! No one needs to get hurt! I said get back! They're gonna kill her, Bruce! They're gonna shoot first and ask questions later! I can't just stand here and do nothing! We can't let that happen! John, don't do anything stupid. Stupid? Me? When have I ever? I'm going to try not to be offended, Bruce. You know how I feel about personal insults. John, John, you're right. You're right. I take it back. Thank you. Although I kind of get where you're coming from. Wayne, about time you showed up. What in the good goddamn is he doing here? Director Waller, John Doe's, uh, been aiding Bruce's investigations. This creature's with you? Amanda Waller, meet John Doe. He's a trusted friend. I'm, uh, I'm here to defuse the situation. I have my doubts, but hell, at this point I'll try anything. Harley's making demands we simply can't meet. Her detonator's on a dead man's switch. She lets it go. This bridge is history. This situation is rapidly spiraling out of control. I'm running out of options. 
Harley is heading towards a cliff, and she's gonna drag all of us with her. You're not helping by having your men close in on her. If anything, you're provoking her to violence. The time for talking is over. All she wants is Riddler's goddamn blood, and that's gone. One of my own people destroyed it. Someone inside the agency. The serum Quinn wanted to make is off the table for good. Why don't we let Bruce try negotiating? He spent a lot of time with Harley recently. <sighs> Give it a shot, Bruce. See what you can do. Stand down, people. Let him through. <laughs> well, well, well. Bruce Wayne. Harley. You made it out of the icebox. Good for you. Should have guessed you were working with Walla. Had me fooled. Up to a point. All I want is Riddler's blood. I get it? I leave Gotham for good. That agency hellbeast says she don't got it, but I know she's lying through her teeth. The serum you're trying to make, it doesn't do what you think it does. How do you know about that? Because I looked into it. It does as much harm as it does good, maybe more. Harley, you're a doctor. You have to understand. It destroys your brain chemistry. Uh-huh. Sure. You're gonna tell me you love me, Wayne? Excuse me? I like a little romance when I'm getting screwed. I'm holding all the goddamn cards. Either they give me what I want, or I play the one that goes BOOM! I ain't fooling around. I'll do it without a second thought. You're not thinking this through. Blow the bridge, you'll die. If the explosion doesn't kill you, the agency will. Bruce, come on. You can do better than that. Harley does not respond well to threats. Well, if I'm gonna die, it's gonna be on my terms, Wayne. Not some agency hex. Stand down! Gonna lose it! Couldn't? Uh, Let me talk to her. I know her better than anyone. I'm so glad you're here, baby! These deadbeats want my head on a stick! You can do it, John. I believe in you. I won't let you down. I have everything worked out. Up here. Trust me. I learned from the best. Okay, just. Just what? Try and reason with her. She thinks you have her best interests at heart. Yeah, that was my plan, Bruce. Hey, don't worry about a thing. With all these people watching, how can I not live up to the occasion? Those two reprobates getting their heads together is a recipe for a disaster. Oh, what were you thinking? Bruce suggested. John said it himself. He knows her better than anyone. As long as he keeps her talking, there's still a chance she won't blow the bridge. There's truth in that. Not enough to inspire confidence, but it's better than nothing. This is going south. We're gonna shut this down right now. If we interfere now, we could push him right back into Harley's arms. If we don't, everyone on this bridge will die. Stand by to move in, people. Alpha team, move into flank. Take your positions. Look for a clean shot. What the hell do you think you're doing? You gotta trust him, Waller. I'm telling you, he'll come through. With a marriage proposal, maybe. Not a successful resolution to the crisis at hand. You need to have faith. Stand down. You backstabbing piece of crap! Don't struggle, Harley. They think you're a fighter. They're gonna put you in the hole. I'm gonna rip your head off, you two diamond son of a- Get her out of here. How could you, John? 
You broke my heart. Bruce showed me how to be good, Harley. In a way you never could. Thank you for your help, Mr. Doe. You did a great job. The virus, please. I don't think so. I don't think anyone should have this. Least of all you. Well then, we'll no longer be requiring your service. No! What are you doing? He helped us. You betrayed me? After I saved the day? <sighs> you agency people! You're just the worst! Find that bag! And get Quinn in the truck immediately! Where's Wayne? I want him secured! Subdue him if you have to! Good to know you have my back. John? You corrupt pigs. You're supposed to stand for justice. But you're liars and you're murderers. You're so goddamn rude. What the heck? What's wrong with this thing? Come on. Work! Yes! That's what I want to see! Ha ha ha!